Falcon 9 is in startup. And now we just heard that Falcon 9 is in startup. Yeah, anything countdown? And in the final countdown, less than a minute to go, and at the time of launch, the space station will be flying 260 statute miles over the west coast of Australia. Dragon, SpaceX, go for launch. And great call out. Dragon 210, copy, go for launch. Great call out that we're go for launch, and we do have a large crowd here in front of Mission Control, waiting to watch Crew 10 take off today. T-minus 15. T-minus 10. pulling over two G's. Next up, we'll have a couple of events happening in rapid succession. Back chill started. First will be that engine chill on the second stage and back engine, which we just heard. And then we'll have Miko or main engine cutoff, where the nine engines on the first stage will cut off ahead of the first and second stages. We'll be separating from one another. Then the single Merlin vacuum engine on the second stage will ignite and continue to carry crew 10 to orbit while the first stage begins its journey back to Earth. Now we're just two minutes into today's flight. The vehicle is traveling just under 4,000 miles per hour. We're just about 20 seconds away from those events that Anna just mentioned. Uh, the nine Merlin engines will shut down here in just about 10 seconds for Miko. Stage separation and SES-1. Main engine cutoff. SpaceX Dragon, two Alpha. Stage liberation confirmed. Copy, two Alpha. Great call outs and incredible views there on your left hand screen. On your left hand screen, you can see a view from stage one. <laughs> and an extremely excited crowd here in Hawthorne. Awesome views of that boost back burn on the first stage, as well as the MVAC engine igniting on the second stage. Great views there. Now the booster is in its boost back burn. This is the first of three burns as it makes its way back down to Earth. This will last about 45 seconds. And the crew, 10 crew, is still on board Dragon attached to Falcon 9 second stage, which you can see there on your right hand screen. And we're now at three minutes and 20 seconds into today's flight. The vehicle is traveling about 6,500 miles per hour. They are on their way to the space station. And we did have that confirmation um, coming up of the boost back shutdown. And then coming up in at the T plus six minute mark. Uh, coming, And there we have our first images of the crew inside the Dragon spacecrafts as they make their way into orbit. The crew, Dragon, SpaceX, nominal trajectory. Continuing to get good call outs. SpaceX, Dragon, copy nominal. 
the stage to continue to be on power with uh, and it's firing until we get to that second stage engine cutoff around the nine minute mark of flight about five minutes of flight to go before dragon will be flying free some cool views there on your left hand screen that's the first stage booster as it's making its way back down to earth this is a ground tracking camera getting these awesome views <laughs> and on the right hand side of your screen you can see that lone merlin vacuum engine of the second stage we're continuing to get good performance on the second stage and the cruise g loads will dip right when we hit the separation events and it's going to continue to build up until then Dragon, SpaceX, nominal trajectory. SpaceX, Dragon, copy nominal. We're now at five minutes into today's flight uh, with a liftoff at 7.03 p.m. Pacific, 4.03 uh, p.m. Eastern, 4.03 p.m. Pacific. Continuing to get good call outs as stage one makes its way back to Earth and stage two continues to fire, propelling Dragon into orbit. If you're just now joining us, the four members of Crew 10 launched from Launch Complex 39A at Kennedy Space Center in Florida. And they're currently on board Dragon, still attached to Falcon 9's second stage, which you're seeing there on your right hand screen. On your left hand screen, the first stage vehicle is making its way back down to Earth. It already completed the first of three burns as the boost back burn. And the next event coming up for that vehicle is going to be the entry burn. Dragon SpaceX, nominal trajectory. Great call outs there. That entry burn is coming up. SpaceX Dragon, copy nominal. That entry burn is coming up here in just under 20 seconds. We'll reignite three of those nine Merlin 1D engines to help slow the vehicle down as it makes its way back into the Earth's atmosphere. We're now just over six minutes into today's flight as Dragon and the second stage continue traveling at over 12,000 miles per hour, making their way into orbit and on the way to the International Space Station. There we just saw on the screen, it was very quick, but we had the entry burn. Which we got some cool views of that from the ground, which is awesome. Now the next event coming up will be the landing burn for the first stage. That's coming up here in about 30 seconds. Dragon SpaceX, nominal trajectory. Again, great call outs for SpaceX Dragon, copy nominal. Confirmation there from the crew as they continue to make their way into orbit. Now seven minutes into today's flight, the first stage making its way back down to Earth and the second stage continuing to fire. This is an awesome view. Let's see if we can see the center engine relight for that landing burn here in a few seconds. There's that landing burn. Let's watch as Falcon 9 touches down on landing zone one. stage has made its way back to earth we're about a minute away from the second engine cutoff which we're expecting around the nine minute mark of today's flight we're continuing to get good call outs and uh, dragon and all of the systems on the vehicle are performing as expected just over eight minutes into today's flight traveling more than 21,000 miles per hour terminal guidance Dragon, displays are configured for launch. And with that, this is the pilot Nicole Lairs, and on behalf of Crew 10, we'd like to say that today, we celebrate the countless individuals all over the world that have made this journey possible. To the engineers, instructors, flight controllers, scientists, and leaders who worked tirelessly to get us here, thank you for your dedication to the safety and success of this mission. And a special thank you to our friends and families for your unwavering love and support 
This mission is a testament of what humans can achieve when we work together. Go Kraken! Such great words from the crew. Again, <laughs> and some cheering going on. You can see that on your screen. SpaceX copies and from the entire SpaceX team here. It's been a pleasure working together to prepare for this mission. And from all of us, good luck, Godspeed, go Crew 10, and enjoy the ride.